One of our busiest times of year is snow removal season. It's one of the topics that garners the most questions and the most complaints. While we can't control the weather, we can do better to define our processes to avoid confusion. We'll start with priorities. Our priority routes are designed to open up as much of the town as possible, as quickly as possible, to provide the best access for emergency vehicles and routes to emergency centers. The map is available on our website. This is a guideline, and once the routes are opened up, crews move into other areas as best they can. However, if snow piles up again in the meantime, priority routes need to be done again. The downtown area is normally done a few days after a snowfall to allow sidewalks to be shoveled onto the street as there's no other places for that snow to go. Patience is key as it does take time to clear the town. Well, the priorities usually take about three to four days and then after that varies depending if you're hauling or just pushing on the side. When we get a dump, we want to try and get all the priorities open and that's the main goal is to keep everybody safe and have minimal snow on the on the streets. Crews are normally out quite early following a significant snowfall to get to work and they do caution residents to give them some room to get their work done. Just be cautious of equipment uh, on the streets. Um, there is generally buried manholes and valves and stuff that you know the blade will catch and it'll stop in your tracks. You know if you're following too close it's very possible that you could drive into the back of the grader or whatever. It's not, there's nothing we can do about it, it's just the hazard that we have to deal with every day. Just to review, a couple of tips for residents include making sure that curb ramps are removed when the snow falls. Curb ramps can damage equipment if it's not noticed while clearing is underway. If you see crews working in an area, please don't park on the street. We're trying to keep residents more informed about the areas crews are working in through social media. Please don't follow equipment too close. As mentioned earlier, catching covered hazards could cause an immediate stop and following too close could lead to a collision. And have patience. Crews work long hours trying to make the roads safe for everyone. It may take some time to get to residential areas, but they are trying to open up as many streets as possible so you don't have to travel far to get to a cleared street. If you have any questions on snow removal, please give us a call. Contact our Public Works Office at 780-723-6461.